Hello guys, it's Remus here and now that we know all the skins for Season 6, I can do my annual video featuring my favorite skins from the year. As always, I will only include one skin from each set, but I may mention other skins from the same set along the way. There were a lot of skins this year and it was pretty hard to pick, but I think I picked 10 of my favorite ones for this year and let me know which one is your favorite and if you agree with my list. There is a new random games giveaway for Christmas, to join subscribe, like this video, share and join using the Glim link from the description. So let's begin the countdown. At number 10 we have Dark Star Trash, a legendary skin that was very well tasted and has amazing effects and animations, even if he throws poor George the Frog in a black hole. He was released in the summer along with Dark Star Varus and it's a really amazing skin. Number 9. Mecha Zero Cyan. A very well made skin with awesome animations, a great recall and a very nice ultimate turning him into a train. This transformer skin is also legendary and is part of the mecha set being the first prototype and the only legendary skin in the set. Number 8, Sashimi Akali, with an honorable mention to another funny skin from the same set, Baker Pantheon. You may say that I have only selected this skin because Akali is my favorite champion and because I like the model, the hair and it's a pretty funny skin, and you would be right. At number 7, there is Hextech Annie, one of the rarest skins and one of the two crafting exclusive skins, along with another great skin, Soul Stealer Vane. I have selected this one because I like the theme of the skin, the effects are also looking awesome and it's overall a pretty unique skin. But she still doesn't know where Tibbers is even if he's silent. <laughs> 
Number 6 Arcade Corky The crate skins are great and Ari was also awesome this year but I think Corky skin is a little bit more interesting with great animations, colorful and great effects and a very cool recall animation I think this skin deserves to be on the list and it's probably the best one out of the three so there were Arcade Ari, Arcade Corgi and Arcade Ezreal for this year's set. Number 5. Blood Moon Yasuo. I'm a big fan of the Blood Moon set, totally not because of Blood Moon Akali. <laughs> and this year had another great two additions. Blood Moon Cannon is also amazing with great effects to his abilities and it's overall a pretty awesome skin. But I think I like this one for Yasuo a little bit more. His spells look great, the colors are very well suited to the team and his recall is great as well. Number 4. I had to include a harrowing skin, and of course that skin will be for Satan himself. Yep. Little Devil Timo was a very interesting addition. Along with Baker Pantheon, they were both very old fan-made skins that finally got added to the game. And they are great. This one was also part of the new Doombots game mode that was added this year. And that was awesome as well. And it looks amazing, with probably the creepiest recall animation in the game, as well as a really nice and creepy death animation. <laughs> Number 3. Star Guardian Jinx. The Star Guardian set is also a very well made one and my favorite skin of the set is definitely Star Guardian Jinx. A great model, two nice little companions and awesome ability effects and animations along with a great recall and new voice lines, new emotes, it's a really awesome skin and it deserves to be on this list. Number 2. Project Ash. The project set is one of my favorite sets in the game, if not the favorite one. And this year added three new ones. Project Katarina and Neko were also great, but I like this one for Ash the most, with a hood that appears when you are in enemy territory, great new emotes and voice lines, a fun dance animation, and a very cool recall. Project Ash is a really awesome skill. Memory 
memories are what make us human. And finally, number 1. An ultimate skin should be the best skin of the year, and same as last year's DJ Sona, I like Elementalist looks the most, and it takes the spot for the best skin of the year in my opinion. With a cool concept of switching stances, giving you 10 skins in one at the price of an ultimate skin, this skin is very worthy, with unique recalls, animations, spell effects and voice lines for each one of the 10 stances, it gives you many opportunities to play the skin differently, based on the two elements that you pick and combine each game. This skin is amazing and I think it deserves to be the first one of the year.